Hi, in this video, we're looking at a straight line, the linear function, and how we would find the equation. Now, I'm sure most of you remember that the equation of a straight line is y equal to mx plus c. In function notation, f of x equal to mx plus c. Now, we're used of this formula, but remember m stands for gradient, and it's just a letter. I can replace m with any letter, and in this case, we can also write it as AX, where A represents gradient, and Q represents your constant. So I want to also expose you that you can have an equation of a straight line in a form Y equal to AX plus 1. What tells us it's a straight line in this case is that we have X to the power 1. So M stands for our gradient, and remember we have a gradient formula, Y2 minus Y1 over X2 minus X1. C is your y-intercept or your constant. Looking at our first example, we want to find the equation of this line. So, to find the equation of this line, firstly, we need to work at A or M, which is your gradient. So we need two points, y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So we are given the intercept, and in this case, the x-intercept is minus 2. In coordinate form, it's minus 2, 0. So remember, minus 2 for x, y represents 0. We're also given the point 4, which is 0, 4. And in coordinate form, x is 0, y is 4. So we're going to now use the formula which states subtract the y values, subtract the x values. So we're going to take 4 minus 0 divided by 0 minus minus 2, which makes this a plus 2. And 4 minus 0 is 4 divided by 2 gives us A to be 2, which is also M, your gradient. So remember, your gradient is 2, whether you're using the first or the second formula. The next thing we need from the graph is the y-intercept. And the Q value or the C value in this case is 4. So we have that. We can now substitute in our equation that Y is equal to AX, which is 2X plus 4 which is the equation of the straight line. Confirmation, 4 is our y-intercept. Also, the gradient of 2 means we have an uphill from left to right. Function notation, we can write this as f of x equal to 2x plus 4. We're now going to find the equation of a line given two points. Remember, the equation of a straight line, y equal to mx plus c. We have our gradient formula y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. We're starting with the gradient. So we have our points xy and xy. So our gradient will be subtract the y values, 3 minus minus 1, which makes it 3 plus 1. And minus 1 minus 3. Use your calculator if you have to, and we get a gradient of negative 1. So we have our gradient. We now need the y-intercept, but you'll notice the y-intercept is not given. So we're going to use our equation, y equal to mx plus c. We know m is minus 1, minus 1x plus c. Our mission now is to find c. All we have to do is sub a point because we have x and y. We've got two points, so you can choose any point you want. I'm going to choose the first point. The value of y is 3. The value of x is minus 1. And we're going to substitute this point into our equation to find C. So 3 is equal to minus 1 times minus 1 plus C, which gives us 3 is equal to minus 1 times minus 1 is a plus 1, plus C. And that gives us C to be equal to 2. Take 1 on the other side, you get 3 minus 1, which is 2. We're now ready to substitute into the equation. So Y is equal to MX plus C. The value of M is minus 1X plus the value of C is 2. Thank you.